Unlike Rush Limbaugh, I am not America's anchor man, but I am anchored on the solid rock of mm. Christ. And I am getting even more anchored when it comes to education and politics. This is the Sophie Scholl Society, and here we mix religion and politics. Parents, you need to really consider getting your kids out of government-run schools. I'm just going to put that on the table. Given what's coming down the pike through state regions, boards, through those in academia at a university level, what we're seeing in education is a total transformation of what education was meant to do. Think about this, the old Deluder Satan Act. That was way back in the 17th century in mm. New England. Education was put in place so that the students would know the word of God. They didn't want Satan to get their young, so they taught the kids how to read in order that they could understand the Bible themselves. Mm. That's not where we're at today in government-run schools. Taxpayer-funded schools do not do this. In fact, what we see now is schools promoting a sex ed program totally undermining Christian morality. In fact, in some schools, if you were to hand those students the agenda or the way in which to educate those kids sexually, you could be put in prison for pornography. Hmm. That's how bad it's getting. But since it's a teacher doing it in the classroom, they're free to do that kind of indoctrination into the students. I'm not saying every school classroom does that. I'm not saying every school district does that. But you see it in California, and it's spreading rampantly throughout the United States. I appreciated what one parent had to say with regard to these Zoom classroom settings. Because one district in Tennessee said, parents, we don't want you to watch what your kids are learning. Hmm, somebody commented, isn't that what a sexual predator tells students not to do? Don't tell your parents. When we observe what's happening in education, we need to remember the words of Martin Luther who basically said, watch out for any type of education that isn't squarely on the Word of God. And American education today isn't what it was when the old Satan Deluder Act was in place centuries ago. Parents, consider, truly consider, pulling your kids from government-run schools. It's time for us as Christians to get out and get our children truly educated on the Word of God. Well, unlike Tony Kornheiser, pardon the interruption, I cannot promise you that I'll do better the next time. <laughs>